Hey, how's it going guys? Stefan is here. Welcome back for another video. In today's video, I'll show you how to use the widgets on the iPhone SE first generation. Super excited as always. So as you know, Apple had an update yesterday, which actually surprised me because we, we had the iOS 14 week ago and Apple just pushed another update yesterday, which is interesting to be honest. So we have the iOS 14.1, which is pretty good actually. So this update fixes some problems, some bugs if you had with your uh, iPhone. But yeah, Apple actually is doing a pretty good job to uh, update the devices pretty frequently, which is uh, kind of amazing to be honest. So um, in today's video, I'll show you how to use the widgets also to talk about this uh, iPhone SC, how it's been uh, so far for the past week. Like I mentioned, this is uh, the iOS 14.1. Yesterday, the update is pushed. So if you check for updates, if you're on an iPhone uh, iOS 14, you can update if you like so. But so far, this device works pretty good. No complaints whatsoever. So let me show you with the widgets now. So let's say, this is the most popular uh, update that Apple pushed for the past couple of years, actually. And now we have widgets. So how to add widgets on your screen? So just swipe here and uh, click on the plus sign. Sorry. So swipe here, edit, click on the plus sign. So as you can see, we have a ton of widgets. We have a small widgets, we have a big widgets which is interesting. So just let's say, for example, I'm going to take the clock widget because I like it and I'm going to place it here. And now, as you can see, we have the clock widget, which is interesting, to be honest, looks pretty nice. Also, let's let's put something else on the screen. So let's put, let's say, let's put the weather why not so just click on the weather plus again click on the weather and swipe it let's say here as you can see we have widget here but you know what let me move it to the other page i think it's interesting so as you can see we have the clock here also we have another widget here, which is interesting. But if you like so, you can you can put two widgets on, on the top. So you can stack widgets. So for example, let me take another widget. And for example, I'm gonna take this one and I'm gonna place it on the top. So as you can see now we have two widgets which is pretty interesting. So if you like, so you can put two widgets on the top, you can stack widgets, uh, but let's say you want bigger widgets. You don't want a small one. So let's take the photos and I'm gonna put the photos just right, come on, here. So now this is me. This is pictures of my photos. So directly I can go to photos from here. Uh, yeah, it's a cool picture. <laughs> Not really. So let's say you want to add more widgets. For example, let's say there's a pretty nice widgets. So like a shortcuts that you can add. Always do the plus sign. So as you can see, we have tips. We have the calendar. Also, we have the Google widget, which is pretty nice. This is very helpful. So let's put it here, for example. And you can type, you can click and directly you can search. Also, you can enable and you can speak, which is pretty good. Also, you can search incognito, which is pretty nice as well. I mean, again, this is, this is pretty, pretty good. Uh, and I think this will work pretty nice on uh, even a bigger display. So let's, for example, let's take the this clock widget and place it here. 
again pretty nice so as you can see you can see the time uh, again this is very good to customize you can add a ton of widgets if you like so you can put widgets on the top which is pretty pretty nice in my opinion so again if you want to remove widget for example it's pretty easy so just tap on the widget and then remove it this is the way to remove the widget uh, pretty pretty easy so yeah i mean you can customize your device depends how you prefer how do you like it so just be creative and i think they're gonna add more widgets uh, for the future for, for now you have this uh, widgets for now the moment also let me show you something which is pretty nice you can remove everything for example you can remove whatever you like with one button which is pretty nice but again let me know what do you think guys do you like the widgets uh, in the comments down below leave your thoughts uh, did you customize your device let me know I'm super excited to uh, know. So yeah, this is Stefan. Hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to smash the like button and also subscribe if it's your first time here. I'm going to uh, make more videos. Uh, probably uh, iOS 14.2 will be pushed probably next week as well. So yeah, make sure to subscribe. If there's any new changes, I'll post uh, uh, as well. So yeah, see you next time, guys.